Hey, what's happening, gamers? I'm K Wing, and this is the audio podcast Sunday Drive Burton Mobile Edition. Oh, yeah. You knew this was happening. You had to know. So, I knew it was happening. I know you knew it was happening. This car and DLC gave us such a difficult time when we were out in Pennsylvania, and I was late. I was so late with everything, and it makes me sad. But next time when we go up to yeah. PA, uh, which is, next I think, time. Wednesday, uh, the DLC for Robin and this DLC, the <laughs> Keaton Mobile. Um, great. You just killed the taxi. I don't care. Take that taxi. I'm gonna blow this Apparently guy up too, just for, the, just for the purpose of doing that. Yeah. Okay, those were all bad guys. Those were all bad guys. Well, they are now. Now they're dead bad guys. Keaton does kill. It's Bob You're Kane, no Batman. different than Jason Todd. Oh yes, I am. I have style. Okay. And I hardly ever talk. And you're not. As and I whiny. smile. I smile. <laughs> and humor. And I have eyebrows. Hello. <laughs> you, you did your eyebrows dance when you talk. They dance with the devil in the pale moonlight. That's what they do. Yeah. It's a crazy world. That's yeah. all I can say. So anyway. But we had no internet. That's why we couldn't upload it. Yes, we were in we a hotel, hotel room, internet. but apparently the hotels don't always have internet, even though they say they have great internet. Lies. <laughs> so our new home has the internet all ready to go. So if we are up there Tuesday or Wednesday, I haven't decided what day we're going because I don't want to miss out on another DLC thing because of traveling. I was really upset because that was the same day that we found out the Tumblr was coming in September. The Dark Knight well, Tumblr. Maybe next time, if you find out DLC is there, just like stop anywhere you are on the road and get a hotel. We we kind of uh, figured out that didn't really work though, because we tried to yeah. do some stuff in the car, and the car apparently can't handle a PS4 and television plugged in at the same time. Yeah, we did try to download it yes. through our car internet, like ghetto, you know, like a hot spot ghetto style on the car, and it just kept the PS4 just kept turning off. It yeah. was like, can't handle it. Can't handle the awesome of the PS4. Boom! Oh, Set yeah. this. So, so yes. Yeah. This Tuesday is the Robin Titan uh, DLC, where it's a, um, I guess you would call it a survival thing to see how long you can beat up the bad guys. And they have a thing called Beat Harry. Wait, what? Robin Teen Titans DLC? Well, that's the name of it. It's called Robin Teen Titan. It, because, you know, they're trolling us. Mm, okay. Yeah. So it's an endurance thing. Think kind of like um, the Penguin Iceberg Lounge and Joker's uh, Circus thing or whatever in um, Amusement Park okay. in Arkham City. You just fight waves okay. of guys until you die. Except it's only Robin. One. It's only playable with Robin. So okay. they've, Rocksteady has issued a challenge where you have to beat one of the developers named Harry who got half a million points. What? Yeah. Oh, it's not hard. It's not hard. I can do that. I can do that. I'm gonna get. I'm going for about a million or six hundred. So the, yeah, the, I I don't know. Blah, blah. The problem with Robin though is he can't break weapons. So you can do like knockdown moves and things like that, but a Nightwing, Robin, and Catwoman cannot do um, like weapon takedowns, which is annoying. But Azrael can do it. Sorry. Wow. Apparently, you're just, kill, you know, just destroying everyone. So, yeah, <sighs> we're going to cover that. And also, um, I have read your guys' comments. I'm up to speed about the Batmobile and things like that. This is the Batman Returns Batmobile because the sound is from the Batman Returns film. It is not the same wow. turbine engine that we heard in That's Batman. That's very perceptive of the uh, subscribers. Well, the wing To recognize are awesome. that, <laughs> that sound. So, what, is this the first time you've really gotten to uh, drive around as a Batmobile? In free uh, roam? Freestyle? Yes. Freestyle, yeah. Freestyle? <laughs> free roam. We're going to have a rap battle <laughs> of the Batman. Really? I drive a car that's in black. I've got fire that comes out the back, yo. <laughs> I clean up the streets with a zip line. I'm done. Never mind. I can't rap. White boy can't rap. <laughs> it was going to... I'm Batman. <laughs> I drive a car in black. I've got jets that come out of the back. Cause I'm bad bad. There. I redeem myself a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. No. You got a car with a zip line, haven't you heard? No, My you sidekick don't. 
is a little bird. No. 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 Okay, I can't either, apparently. Yeah. I'll no, work on you... that one for next time. Yeah, for next time. So, right. <laughs> there is a zip line that comes out of the Keaton Mobile, but you can't use it in this game. In fact, none of the weaponry uh, is in this game at all. Uh, when you shoot missiles, they're using the same uh, trajectory that the tank mobile has, so it comes out of the top. Yeah. And I was really hoping that, oh, there's Cyanus, that we could, um, you know, have the, the guns come out, because there's, I'm gonna slow down here and pan the camera. Cyanus is our friend. Well, yeah, not really. See the, uh, little bat symbols right there on top of the oh, car? Yeah. That's yep. where the 60 caliber machine guns come from. They're supposed to come from. Right. And uh, right here on the tires, see those little bats? The circles? Oh, Those yeah. are bombs. Wow. And he also has a missile launcher or another weapon right on the side of the vehicle. And he has a flamethrower that comes out the back. Okay, this car looks cooler than all the other oh, yeah. vehicles. Yeah. It yeah, just it has more style. Boom! <laughs> Style, grace, So, K-Wing, what's been going on with the move? Oh, that's right. I'm still moving to Pennsylvania. And, and we did a vlog. We did a vlog. We couldn't, we couldn't post it on K-Wing's Let's Play, so we posted it on this channel, so you can actually see it. We actually had problems logging we, into K-Wing's Let's Plays for, like, yeah. five days. I don't we know are, what was up with that, but we, we are get not on. in the vlog, no. so you just see the... The rooms because we were both traveling, so our hair was all crazy. And I stuff. had DBZ hair, <laughs> and Amber looked like Vegeta. <laughs> Bulma, you had Bulma hair. There we go. That works. Uh. So yeah, we didn't want to be on camera, and everyone's like, "No, I wanted to see you." That's crazy. the whole point of vlogs. What are it's you doing, like, no. guys? No, we broke. We broke the mold. Oh snap! That was cool. Uh, and then, <laughs> then we got in trouble with our, our grandma who was like, "You shouldn't show so much of your house and personal stuff." Stop showing things to strangers. <laughs> it's like, sorry, grandma. It's like that's our that's our life. <laughs> Is oh, they're not strangers. They're our friends that we have never met. They're my thousands of adopted <laughs> children that I haven't signed any of the paperwork for, like Yamada. Which, if you guys watch Working, then you'll know what I'm talking about. If you don't, then. You are deprived of one of the funniest anime in existence for like the past couple years. Waganari. But um, I'm, I'm excited about it. The only thing that Luke is kind of worried about, about Pennsylvania, well, okay, there's several things, but we still haven't figured out if there's a Taco Bell nearby, our new place. But we have an Arby's. We have an Arby's, so we, have we an might Arby's have to do a trade. 15 minutes away. There might be a trade of... Arby's for Taco Bell. Why? Why? That should be a national law that there should be an Arby's and a Taco Bell within 20 miles of every place. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's just that someone needs to make sure that there are more Arby's around. I'm just saying. And Taco Bells. Is right, it Katie? weird that I still have that strange Batman rap in my head? Yeah. I Yeah, that's pretty weird. So we've got, um, well, you probably saw from the blog, we've got our the office set up, and we got some of K-Wing's bat bathroom set up. So. Although we have more of the bathroom stuff here, so I yeah, need to bring that over. Yeah, we're going to, we'll have to do another Soap vlog dispenser. where we show the bat bathroom set up. And then every time you go there, you can say, to the bat bathroom. The bathroom. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was terrible. Anyway. I'm losing my bail voice. I guess yeah. I'm coming of age. Yeah, yeah. I can't do it anymore. No. How old was Bale when he did that? Oh my gosh. I don't it was know. all a computer. I feel oh. so let down. It was all. No, no, no. All I thought lied. the first one was real. The first real. one was real. <laughs> the second one was The second like, time and the third time he faked it. I think that he was. I think that he was losing his voice and maybe they had to do it. I and just like Kevin Conroy say, whatever director or like, you know, voice coach or. You know, guy who was on set who let him do that voice, they need to be ashamed of themselves. Yeah, they should have at some point gone, Said no, 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 no. We just can't do this. It sounds horrible. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, I don't know what else is going on. I, I made What's a What's going on I, is I'm making this car look awesome. Luke made like eight bins of stuff, put eight bins together. Yep, I, put, I magically constructed eight bins out of <laughs> no, thin you, you air, and then I put in stuff in them. And I filled one bin. So I'm really proud of myself. Yep. 
I was actually amazed that she got rid of uh, one bin I in did, the course of a day. I did go get Luke Taco Bell for yes, sustenance. She, she did that. But I'm really thinking, and I'm thinking about the whole Taco Bell thing, that it's combined with Long John Silvers. No. Yep. And I tried Long John Silvers uh, like a few weeks ago. Because if that's the and case, I'm not gonna say anything more. Then about that. there just, is one halfway to Grandma's if we go on that other highway. That's where it is. Yeah. So. Oh, okay. But I, I don't like. So yeah, the pretty much we're just you know tired from moving, so it's just like yeah, we're just here. Hello. Driving around in the Keaton mobile with Michael at the wheel. Yep. Because actually the the Keaton suit and is. In, yeah, K Wing is getting really excited for uh, doing the Keaton, like doing a whole thing on what Keaton movie could have been and all the things they cut out. Yes, like by Sam Ham. So I have that lore mostly studied, although. Um, I need to watch the film again so I make sure I get all my quotes completely accurate because, you know. You better. Yes. Because I'm going to be on your back about that. We're all going to be nitpicking you. Everybody nitpicks me for that. But, well, uh, I, I have about a 20 different accounts of uh, trolling accounts. I knew that! <laughs> so, so most of that uh, Joker debunking I, stuff, I that come, was you, wasn't I, uh, it? Uh, yeah. No! What? <laughs> no, you can't prove anything. But I, I do like to... Tr no, I don't really... Rule of Maybe thumb, I, I should not vlog <laughs> angry. Even though I had some really good points, I came off kind of like... Uh, not the nicest Joe, so... It's kind of fun when you're angry, though. Oops. <laughs> Sometimes. So what's going on with Arkham Knight? Are you going to keep doing all kinds of content, gaming? What's going on? Once I've settled in, I mean, we've got the Dick Grayson skin we have to go over. So Excuse me, the iconic black and gray. There were people challenging me in the uh, comments saying, so No, it's, it's the iconic. It's like, his ears are way too tiny for it to be iconic. Also... The belt is Dick Grayson. Oh, all this again. The here. belt is Grayson, and so are the gloves and the boots. Batman I'm, does not have tiny boots. He's not. I like, pixie I have boots. to say the ears would be a big part of it, and oh yeah, I think that people need to acknowledge that Nightwing was Batman. So yeah, they. He's an awesome Batman on. too. Yeah, so I would have to go with that. But I know everyone has their own opinion, so people's opinions are wrong. <laughs> Um, I just wanted to show this too. Notice how the shadow is a bat. You see that? Oh my god! You see that? That's how well wow, this car was designed. Oh, that's awesome. That's how well. Oh my gosh, that's pretty it's cool. Woo! So yeah, so Kaming, how long is it gonna take uh, you to get settled into the new place then? Well, we have a bed done and we have my office desk. Uh, which are you is... gonna have two apartments forever? No, there's a misconception that Amber and I are gonna have two places. Um, no, we're moving from one place to the other. Right. We just need to move slowly because it actually helps Tink too yes. to move slowly because she doesn't. We don't want to. She's you know sweet and we don't want to make her like hate us. We don't want to turn her into an angry cat. Yeah, she got me good. She got me really good. So recently. she's having a hard enough time as it is. So we're actually trying to move things. Luca's, uh, you know, having everything kind of towards the front of our um, apartment here, and um, you know, like so Tink can kind of like sit on the boxes. I'm also trying to make it easier on the movers so we don't get sued if somebody pulls their back. Cause that Atari games, like that bin, I hurt my back on that thing. That's way too heavy. There's like 700 cartridges in that. Yeah. And it's like it's wicked heavy. I'm surprised. It's like this is just Atari games. It's like, my NES stuff doesn't weigh this much. You yeah. Know? So. Totally. Yeah, so T Tink is kind of like putting her scent on everything, just rubbing up against it and stuff. Oh! oh Whoa, that was pretty that awesome. That was awesome. What is this? Stunt, Micro Machines stunt show. But yeah. yeah. So that's basically what we're doing, just boring, moving stuff. and. Oh, moving's difficult. Moving stuff. And then I, I, I just can't wait for, uh, you know, Disney Infinity 3 and all, all the games that are coming out and stuff like that. Well, some of the games got delayed that we were doing. And we are still doing Godzilla and Toy Soldiers and stuff like that. It's just been so hectic. 
So we're gonna uh, try to get uh, Godzilla and uh, Toy Soldiers recorded. <laughs> and, and yes, stuff like that is now our go-to phrase <laughs> when we don't know what else to say. What? What's our go-to Stuff phrase? like that. <laughs> stuff like that? Really? And, and stuff like that. We've said it a few times. Oh, we have? Vlog. Yeah. Oh, so that's, that's our new... Uh, yeah, we've said stuff. We've said that and stuff like that. Yes. A Batman, my car is black. <laughs> Fire comes out the back. Evil beware as I pull down the streets. So... Prowl. Dang it! Yeah, we hope you guys are all having an awesome time in school and stuff Ooh. like that. Oh, I said it again. You said it. Yeah. Yay, school. Batman doesn't go to school. He prowls the streets in a car. In Batman his lap. learns a lot of stuff. Yeah, Batman. but he he's a he's a homeschooler. He is kind of a homeschooler. He kind of went all over the world and kind of learned what he needed to. Well, actually, would it be a homeschooler or I'm a foreign exchange student? Pretty sh well, kind of, but I'm pretty sure he also went to college before that. He got kicked out of college, depending on what incarnation oh, you're reading. Oh, it depends. Yeah. yeah. He doesn't but he have still went degree. for a while. He's a college dropout. Not that you should be. That's just what Batman did. Clark Kent uh, graduated, though, I believe. And so did... Um, John Stewart? Not John. John Stewart. And John Jones is a Martian, so yeah, he doesn't. He could fake an ID and go there. He could pull like a, a Chuck Princeton, you know, thing that the government just writes for you after you know all this oh, stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they do that. Sometimes they'll give you an honorary degree. If you give me that. a degree, government. Please. No. You have to do something like you have to like make solve world hunger or. What if I write an amazing Batman script? Oh crap! It depends. I mean, you might cool. be able to get it. Yeah, you could. I don't know. I could get it uh, like uh, autographed by Jim Lee and it'd be like, dude, this is an amazing script. Can we use this in our next Batman game or movie? It'd be like, sure you can, Jim Lee. I'm on a first name basis with Jim Lee. That would be like my dream right there. To be on a first name basis with Jim Lee. Yes. That's your dream? Well, it's one of them. Also to shake Kevin Conroy's hand without freaking out and scaring him. <laughs> what if you just went up to Jim Lee and didn't know him and just said, Hey, what's going on, Jim Lee? You would technically be on a first-hand name basis with him because you called him by his first name, whether or not he was okay with it. <laughs> What, would I have to call him Mr. Lee? Actually, or Jim DC Lee wouldn't be his first name. Guy? That would be his first Full name. and last name. Yeah. First, yeah. I just want Full to call him that. Basis. But I, I did uh, see Kevin Conroy in New York City that one time, but I was too paralyzed with fear and You really saw him? Yeah, yes. you were telling me you thought you saw him walking across the road. He is so easy to to notice, though. I mean, uh, there's not He's many people tall. that look like Kevin Conroy. Yeah. He said very Oh, was he wearing face. his Batman suit that no, day? No. no, he wears like a black polo shirt. <laughs> no, I'm serious, he does. He has like a blue jeans. Uh, I'm not a stalker. If you were Kevin, if you were the voice of Batman, you'd probably wear a t-shirt that said, I'm Batman, every day. I already wear a t-shirt like that. Yeah. Why, why do I, I... I'm just, you know... I prefer your Superman t-shirt. No! Why would I wear a Superman shirt? You're wearing it right now. I am? <laughs> no! <laughs> I've just... My favorite. I've tainted this. You know what I always wanted to see? I know it would never happen, but... When the Batman-Superman team up... Uh, when everybody talked about it in the 90s and things like that, I wanted to see Christopher Reeve and Michael Keaton... Oh my gosh. And then there was a so point cool. where I wanted to see Dean Kane and Michael Keaton in a team up movie. Yeah. Because Dean Kane to me just looked like Superman more than Christopher Reeve. I'm sorry. I agree. He he had that whole like, you know, alien thing down cuz he is uh, a mixed race. Like Dean Kane yeah, is Japanese American. Mhm. Mm and he looks like, you know, he looks like he's not from around here. Exactly. And that's part of the reason they cast him. Mhm. Mm that far off look in his eye on another planet called Japan. It is like another planet. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> I don't want to back up. This car is just way too cool. Oh, it's like I I'm don't... fulfilling a lifelong dream of driving. Yeah. Well, in, in a sense, I'm kind of driving this car, but not Dean really. Dean Kane is just overall like somebody that you could actually. Whoa, Whoa what was that? that? Was what was that? So maybe it was freezing because I'm talking about Superman. It can't but, uh, handle Dean Kane. <laughs> yeah, Dean Kane is so awesome. But it's like his character and Lois and, and Clark, it, it was just like 
I don't know, he just seemed more relatable. He was so much fun. Like, I don't know, I just... I mean, Christopher Reeve started it all in the first, you know, he was the first incarnation. Well, no, he wasn't. Never mind, no, he wasn't. But, George, like, the big George, blockbuster. Is it George Reeves was the first guy? Is that what is? I think that was, yeah, Reeves sounds really familiar. I think it was George Reeves. But, um, yeah, I mean, everyone thinks of Christopher Reeve or whatever as Superman, but I, I like, I think Dean Cain did a better job. I would have, I would have... I would have voted for Dean Kane over uh, Christopher Reeve for a movie Superman. Did you know that the Lois and Clark show actually say Batman's name a couple times? Oh, really? They talk about Gotham. Mm -hmm. They yeah, they name drop. So when people made like these fan films of uh, you know Michael Keaton and uh, Dean Kane being in a Superman thing, they actually had a plot where you know. Dean Kane was saying, no, that's Batman, or Batman's behind bars, and goes crazy because he killed people. It, w it was a great little fan film. Wow. This was going back in, like, 2004, 2005, though, but it was... Can you really imagine, though, like, them standing up next to each other? Dean Kane would be so much more muscular than, uh... Yeah, Michael Keaton. Keaton's just kind of this <laughs> lanky guy, you know? Yeah. But he still refers to himself as Batman. When people ask him, and they're like, how do you feel about, uh... You know, Ben Affleck being Batman, and Keaton's like, I am Batman. Really? Yeah. He's, really? Yeah. That's awesome. Yep. And Kevin Conroy sees himself as Batman. Val Kilmer and George Clooney, they even say, I'm not Batman. That's the other guy. Oh, really? Bale even said that uh, Keaton was Batman, too, so... I don't really? know what Kevin Conroy thinks of... He's Out of all the other Batman, I've never heard Conroy at a convention talk about Keaton. Like... In a good or bad light. He's made fun of um, George Clooney for the bat nipples. He's talked about um, uh, Val Kilmer's performance and how it was just kind of eh. He talked about Bale's voice. Yeah. He's never said anything about Keaton. And Maybe that, I, was, that yeah. was the stuff that he really had to watch, though, when they were making the animated series. Oh, yeah, because you can, like, we were talking about it before, there's influence from the Keaton films in the mm -hmm. animated series. Oh, you can see it. In oh, fact, uh, drop a little bit of trivia for you guys. Did you know that the art background used in the very first Batman film was later incorporated into DC Comics for Gotham City in 1991, and it lasted until Cataclysm, the earthquake in DC Universe? And then Gotham had to be rebuilt. But they used the skyline and the amazing uh, background by that famous artist who, uh, I'm trying to remember his name, but he was an amazing background artist in the movies. And from DC, the Keaton movies? From the Keaton, yeah. yeah. He passed away before... Um, wow, so they used that for the... Uh, the entire thing of Gotham for the skyline and a lot of the locations for wow. years, and almost 10 years in the comics. Mm -hmm. Pretty awesome. Yes. So, so yeah, yeah. That, that was totally random, but just driving this car makes my head... The more you know. Exactly. So it's too bad that Keaton can't do any missions or anything because he's discriminated against for his awesomeness well, in, I, this, in this car here. He has to stay in the car. This is Sunday Drive. It has to be the car. Fine. Oh. This is the whole point. He's just going for a drive. That's right. And it's a Sunday, so it's fitting. We'll have Lucius fix the car later after his drive. The car is completely fine. Look at it. But he's smashing into everything. I know, but it's just... it It's amazing. You don't, you don't need to worry about it. This car can take it. Although, I mean, you know... I think if I was Batman, I would want to... Instead of driving around Gotham, I'd just, like, drive away from Gotham, and I'd drive through a nice field of posies or something. Whoa, posies! No, that yeah. does, you're not driving through. <laughs> through daffodils. They would have to be scary posies. No, yes. it'd, be, it'd be funny if you drove through a nice field of flowers or something. It would not be funny. <laughs> I would just... I would... No, I, that, the car cry. does not... The car works here, because this is kind of like... Whoa! What is this? This is like... Stunt show. Seriously. Yep. Uh, doing all kinds of things to this poor car. So, I don't I'm, know. I'm putting this car through its paces. Boom. But, uh, yeah, I think that's gonna conclude Sunday Drive. Uh, know that I am working on the Keaton Lore video. It should be up Monday night. 
And then we'll be doing the Batman DLC for Robin. And then you guys who don't have season pass, you'll be able to download the 1989 Batman on August 25th along with his races. Out of my way, flat top. That's, yep. that's, a, that's a cop. And you are actually in the 1989 skin right now, but... I am in it. You can't, can't see it. You can't see it because, you know but what? Keaton is actually in the Batmobile yes. right now. Keaton, you know what? Fine. We are going to do something that's never been done in Sunday Drive. No! Don't yes, taint no. it! It has to be tainted. Here he comes. And it slides back! Oh! It slid back! That is that amazing. Look at cool. that. It's just like in the movie. Oh, wow. that's so cool. Well, you just ruined Sunday I Drive. I did. I it's ruined it. Over. Anyway, guys... I've totally uh, blasphemed Sunday Drive, but it was worth it just to see so, the thing slide. So, basically, to recap, um, just, like, give us time. We're, we're moving. We are going to move by the end of this month. We're just taking more time. And well, the start of September will we're fully blame, be in there. We were going to blame this on Tink that we're moving slowly for her, but... And the moving guys, because they, they gave us a date. They, they can't just... Apparently, you can't just show up when somebody wants to move. What yeah. happens if somebody gets evicted? I'm just saying. You have to wait for the movers to come, have all your stuff out in the rain or something like that. I mean, jeez. So, I mean, they, they gave yeah, us some time well, and a Yeah, a lot of people who are evicted, they do have their stuff thrown out on the lawn. Oh, that's terrible. Yeah, that's what being evicted is, is horrible. Now I feel sad. Well, yeah. anyway, guys and gals, that does it for this episode. Make sure you mash that like button for the Keaton Mobile. I'm trying to stop Ooh. all cool like. There we go. Thanks so much for taking the time to watch. Uh, again, Keaton lore tomorrow night. And we'll have the Robin challenge map all the next day on Tuesday. Sometime. Uh, cool. PS4 owners, I've noticed that it happens in the afternoon. So Tuesday yeah. afternoon, we'll be looking at the... Beat Harry challenge map. And um, let us know what you guys are doing that's exciting this week in your awesome, exciting lives. Yes, I want to know about your awesome, exciting lives and what you think about the Burton Mobile in action. God bless and happy gaming. We'll see you with something else tomorrow. Bye-bye. See ya.